Welcome to TNR Lifestyles. My name is Tanya. And I'm Rhonda. And we have a special guest today, my daughter. Amber. Hello. <laughs> Welcome, Amber. Welcome, Amber. Amber. And we also have another special guest. Come on, come on, come on. All right. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm Judah. <laughs> Welcome, uh, Judah. Welcome, Amber and Judah. Yeah. We're going to do a special, special recipe today. Rhonda. Okay, today we're going to be doing another plant-based recipe. This one is called cabbage roll. So these are our ingredients. Our main ingredient is cabbage. Everyone see our cabbage, we've already cut it up. And we use um, plant-based crumbles. And if you want to, you can use, um, you, you don't have to use it, but we're gonna use it. Um, a cup of carrot, a cup of mushrooms, portobello, one onion cut and chopped, and a medium-sized bell pepper already cut and chopped. Okay, we have, we're gonna use olive oil, and whatever your favorite um, pasta sauce, that. I use the smoked paprika, some people call it paprika, paprika. Garlic powder. Of course, Lowry's. Oh, Lowry's, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Himalayan sea salt, black pepper, and some cumin. Okay, some who? Ready? Say that again, one. Cumin. Cumin. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, we're ready. So what we're going to do is put about a teaspoon of olive oil. You're going to turn our oven and let it be preheating to about six. And... Mm -hmm. So, we're going to let that, the onions go ahead and start cooking. Let's cook our onions down. We're going to add our bell pepper. And let that cook. Okay? So, let's let that cook for a little while. And then we're going to come back and we're going to um, look at our other things. Okay, our onions and bell, pep bell peppers are cooking now. Look at our onions. Let's see how our onions look with the bell pepper. So now we're ready to add our mushrooms. So let's add our mushrooms. Mm-hmm. Mm, this looks good. Now we're let that cook down a little bit. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to add our um, carrots. And we're going to stir that. Let that saute a little bit. If you like our mushroom saute. I'm going to turn the heat down to about four now. Just turn it down. That looks good, Ron. This smells good. Girl, this is going to be good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It smells good. Okay, so we're going to let that cook down a little while. Okay, we'll be back. We'll be back. So what? So tell me about this. Um, it's like a tomato, like... Yeah, you uh, put the tomato um, sauce in there. Mm -hmm. And... Um, it really is locale because you have your cabbage, which is locale, and this whole entire pack is like 180 calories, mm. and it doesn't have the fat content in it that you would have with um, traditional ground beef. Mm -hmm. So um, now my concern also is sugar, because I, I want I want to stay away from a lot of sugar. The only thing is, you know, the tomato paste and ketchups and stuff like that have that they already have the built-in tomato. Mm -hmm. I mean, um sugar in it mm. in the tomato paste. So, so this one says no sugar added. That one says no sugar. Okay, cool. We're good. Okay. Okay. No sugar added on. Okay. So Okay, we're cool. ready to add the ground beef. Okay. We're let that saute a little bit. Well not the ground beef, I'm sorry. Crumbles. The ground beef crumbles. <laughs> My next time this smells so delicious. Uh. Mm -hmm. Now y'all this loud is let me tell you something loud. <laughs> I'll do up on this right here. Okay. <laughs> This is Lowry's baby. Okay. Oh. And let me tell you something about this one. Paprika. Sweet paprika. Baby. This is some good it's stuff. Good. Now, right on. It's good. It really is. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're ready to add the um this is really just half of a cabbage. Oh. And I make God. sure that um, you know, you put the green leaves in there. Mm -hmm. because that has a lot of you know the vitamins that your body needs so okay. so we're going to add our cabbage so we have our ground our 
plant-based crumbles and then we're gonna put our cabbage in. Hopefully it won't all fall out <laughs> on the side. Hopefully most of it will end up in the pot. And it's, you better put your hands in it. I, 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 but see, I know other people are going to be eating other than nah, you. Know, know, you know. Just like I you get our popcorn, <laughs> put your hands in it, put your hands in it. <laughs> Typically, I would, but okay. We're going to see all the green leaves right there. I see it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because those have a lot of our nutrients in it. Okay, now we're ready to add our ingredients. And y'all again over here mm -mm. at Tea and Our Lifestyle. Mm -mm. We don't measure, y'all. Mm -mm. We just kind of. <laughs> so you put about a half a teaspoon of cumin. And then I put about um, several, about two to three. These are um, bay leaves. You can also use basil leaves. And then I put in um, garlic powder, not salt, because the salt adds a little more sodium. So that's about a teaspoon of garlic powder. And then we're gonna add about a teaspoon of black pepper. And then we're going to add about a teaspoon of salt, the Himalayan salt. Okay, so we're gonna add a little bit of the um, Lowry seasoning. I'm gonna add a little bit, just a little bit. I'm gonna have to get the other one out. And then also we're going to put in our paprika. And we're going to put the cover on, the top on, and let the one thing about cabbage, oh, sorry, we're going to add our tomato paste, or tomato sauce, as some people may call it. And I just add the entire jar of it. And then it's just going to, um, Cook down. We're gonna cover it, and we're gonna come back and see what it looks like. Okay. okay, everyone, this is what it looks like. This is our cabbage roll. It's really good. Enjoy.